see the one of the most important problem from the chapter of motion in a plane it is a PYQ previous year question and it is for 4 marks and very interesting problem O is a point on the ground chosen as origin a body first suffers a displacement of 10 rotometers in north east and next 10 meters north and finally north west how far it is from the origin that is the question children O is the point on the ground so here simply we are going to take now it is so it is the origin so it is the origin O from that so I am taking this is the east and this is the north and this is the west and this is the south here what are you are saying a body first suffers a displacement of 10 root 2 meters in north east this region is the north east so how much distance he was when 10 root 2 displacement clear after that it is moving again next 10 meters north so this is what 10 meters O I am saying it is A and now this is what B so AB direction is what north and after that finally to the north west finally to the north west so very here now I am extending this one here so after that here like this so according to the given problem that should be like this children uh, it is start from the O OA in the direction of north east north and east clear and we will make some angle here 45 degrees and next here AB that is what towards north towards north S yes. how much distance was given 10 meters and finally northeast north to sorry north to west so this is from here to here that is what B C is in the northwest direction northwest direction here from the diagram what I have to say OA is equals to BC why because from origin to the particular point A that is quite similar is OA is equals to BC we are saying that's why here this is now 10 root 2 meters from here what I have to say BC is equals to OA that is how much 10 root 2 meters so that is the given data here what you have to find out finally how far it is from the origin so now we want to find out the displacement O to C O to C we have to find out it so OA is displacement AB is displacement BC is the displacement but finally it is now it is completely if you can take O A B C it is a distance it is a distance now what you have to find out how far it is from the origin from O to C how much distance or how much displacement it is there we have to find out that that is the problem we have to do so here we are using the concept of resolution of vectors resolution of vector children so here now O A it is there so here I am going to draw two long lines like this so it is I am showing going to say this is the OD and this OE this is the OD and this is OE so this vector OA is divided into two components OE is the horizontal OE is the horizontal component OE is what horizontal component and OD is the vertical component so what we know children if it is the vector u if it is the angle it is there that should be divided into components like this ux that is u cos theta you can take and vertical component is what ui that is u sin theta u sin theta 
like that here what we have this is the 10 root 2 what we are going to say this is o a o a and what i am going to say this is a e and this is o e how much angle is there theta is equal to what 45 degrees clear so what you have read simply it is u x is equal to u cos theta like that here well u l is what 10 root 2 so this is what 10 root 2 cos theta and this is 10 root 2 sin theta clear so here what is a e means what 10 root 2 sin theta o e means what 10 root 2 cos theta here 10 root 2 sin theta theta value is how much 45 degrees there so sin theta and 10 root 2 sin 45 degrees that means what 10 root 2 into sin root means 45 means what 1 by root 2 root root 2 cancel then what you get this is 10 clear so that's why here what you have to say a e is the 10 root 2 cos theta and 10 root 2 sin theta a e is what i am going to say this is a e 10 root 2 sin theta what we got 10 and the difference is the what what is y axis that's why it is 10 z clear and now obviously here 10 root 2 cos theta horizontal again 10 root 2 into cos 45 degrees again cos 45 degrees is what 1 by root 2 10 into root 2 means 1 by root 2 root 2 to cancel again what again this is 10 clear so 10 i if you can take it is like 10 i so that's why here simply whatever take in this case this value a e value is 10 and a e means what nothing but again o d a e is what a e is equals to o d that is what 10 and here o e is what 10 I, like that clear and after that clear after that what you have to say now again this 10 root also this vector also divide into two components like this again same thing so this is the again horizontal and this is the vertical so this is what again u x equals to u cos theta and u y is equals to u sin theta same process again what do you get same process so that's why here what do you get here i am going to say some a this is the f okay now c f c f is what is what do you get 10 and f b also will get 10 clear so again same process you learn from the figure what you write f c is equals to u sin theta what is u value 10 root 2 and what is sin theta sin 45 theta is again this is what 45 degrees then what you get fc is equals to 10 root 2 into 1 by root 2 root 2 root 2 cancel then fc is what 10 so and next thing here this is the same thing what it is fb is equals to what u cos theta again same u means there 10 root 2 and cos theta means what cos 45 then 10 root 2 into 1 by root 2 then again what you get 10 so again what you have to simply here this is the 10 and this also here 10 will get so here now finally what we are going to find here from figure from figure what do you write oc means what you have write the distance from here o to c we have to find out because the body is started from the start point o and finally this is the point c that's why here from figure what do you write oc is equals to od od plus df plus and cf clear oc is equals to od plus df plus cf so here how much what od is 10 rd was given a to b is 10 meters and what you got c to f also 10 that's why here what you write oc is equals to here what do you write children 
So if you can take vector form also, you can write here simply OC means nothing but OI axis. So OC I E C equals to OD means what here? Uh, sorry, Y axis J. OD means what here? N J. Again, this is what D F. Again, 10 J. Again, this is also 10 J. Why we are taking here J J means it is along the Y axis. So here O C into J is equals to J of 10 plus 10 plus 10. J J cancel. Then what you get simply here 10 plus 10 plus 10. Therefore O C is equals to 30 meters. The distance from starting point go to the final point C when it is moves initially in north east direction 10 root meters in north direction 10 meters and next uh, finally north west 10 root meters that is the point C then the how far finally how far it is from the origin is whatever right simply how it is 30 meters